Hey lovers, thank you so much for coming by another Lyrics Breakdown. So normally the Lyrics Breakdown is over there on my own podcast, but we have given it its own home. So make sure my faithful lovers that have been listening to the podcast for over 11 years, that you are now listening to the individual podcast because Lyrics Breakdown is here. More Tea with D is in one category, and I am D Shields in another, right? So I am excited. You already know how it goes when I hear some relationship tea, when I hear some relationship talk, and I am definitely hearing it right now in the news still over it. I'm not over it. I can't get over it. The new Still Over It by Summer Walker. That album is fire. No one can have anything bad to say about that album. Everyone is going to find a song that is for them in that album. For the ladies that are going through, for those who are heartbroken, for the persons who say that, you know what, I don't have no issues in my relationship. They gonna find some issues in their relationship in the Still Over It album, right? So, listen... Even if your relationship is perfect, you are going to take a listen to this album and you are going to find something that you can go at your significant other about, okay? So if you need to get it off your chest this season, you are going to be able to do it with the new Still Over It by Summer Walker. So listen, I cannot go on and on without at least breaking down one of the songs. I'm trying to figure out which one is my fave and it's just so many. Like, if I love my man at the moment, then I'm definitely loving screwing. Um, <laughs> because it gives us everything that we need in this stuff. So when I love him, no, I'm joking. I love my man at all times. But listen, chat back with me if you are not over on social audio everywhere that you are tuned in. There should be an option for you to chat back. So if this link is up on Twitter, then chat back with me there. If, if you're listening and you click via Facebook, then chat back with me there. Um, wherever you are taking a listen to this conversation, do so, okay? And make sure you're joining me over on the Wisdom app. I am a top mentor over on Wisdom and get some relationship talk over there also. So um, let me let, make sure that they know and that they can chat back over there on Facebook. And then we're going to just get on into these lyrics of Unloyal. So like I said, I love um, the Still Over It album by Summer Walker is what we're all talking about. If you're talking about any other album, you're off topic right now. So we're talking about every song on the album and just trying to break down which one is the favorite. Unloyal, look, Summer Walker in London on the track, I understand that y'all are going through some things and I wanna be upset like all the ladies. I do. I want to be mad at London on the track, and I am. But listen, there's some things that he brings to the table that I cannot have separate from Summer Walker, baby. And that's that production. So the produ- the, the production on Unloyal? Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Like, this song right here is everything. You cannot play this. You have it on your phone. Play it through your AirPods, you are going to fall in love. If you play it in your car, you're going to fall in love. If you play, I don't care where you play it at. Wherever you listen to this unloyal track, you are going to fall in love. So, of course, Summer Walker and Ari Lennox come in and bring the lyrics and just make it just fire as well. But London on the track, I have to give you all your props as far as production goes when it comes to this song. So, y'all don't break that part up. Okay, this still over it album and these tracks and the production. Look, please, I know you have, um, you guys have some things that you're going through and it's going to take a lot of years. I know you have a baby that you're going to raise. So it's a lot that's going to happen over the years that's, you know, off topic from the music. And I'm sorry to see Summer Walker going through that in London on um, the track. I expect you to do better and be better. But until then, do not break up the union that is music when it comes to you too. Please do not do that. So, why do you love the lyrics so much, D Shields? Why are you so in love with a loyal look? You have to have been through something. If you have not, you may not be grown enough for Unloyal. Can I just say that about the lyrics? Some of you are not grown enough for Unloyal. You have not lived life. So if you have not lived life, that's why you can't relate. But if you have lived life, then you are feeling the lyrics to Unloyal. 
Okay, so I've been through some things. I've shared that with you in my books, shared it on the podcast. If you're real nosy, you've seen it on my Facebook. I've been through some things, so I can relate to the lyrics, right? But there are some people that are going to act like, girl, ain't never nothing ever happened in my relationship. Bitch, you lying, but that's okay. We know that you're going to find something in this song that is for you. So let's break down these lyrics, okay? Listen, Summer Walker comes in and started the song. I'm a beat lover, and, you know, I'm all about making sure that what's happening in the lyrics is matched with the beat. So the music just does it for me, and I cannot stop saying that enough, right? But um, you'll just listen to the track over and over and over again. I'm telling you, Unloyal is one of those, especially if you're sitting in your relaxation glass of wine vibe mode, right? Listen, she said, I ain't taking your... Today, no, I ain't taking your tomorrow, no. That's when she start that out. You just gonna scream, you gonna throw your phone, you gonna say I'm over it. Oh my god, yes, you're gonna love it. So, that if you have to be somewhere with a, a significant other, a lover, in order to really feel what she's talking about, so especially for those who have just had a breakup or a divorce or something like that, you're really gonna get it. But if you just argue with your boo, you're gonna feel me as well. <laughs> So one thing that my man will do, especially since the Summer Walker album came out, if we get into an argument, he is going to start rolling his eyes because he knows I'm going to my playlist. I got some for that. Yeah, that, that that we're arguing about right there. Mm-hmm. Summer Walker wrote me a song for that too, you know. So, so trust me, you know, I've been through a lot, as most of you on my socials know, over the last couple of weeks. So I have listened to hours and hours of driving of Summer Walker when I was on my flights back and forth. I listened to Summer Walker to Texas and back to Colorado in my ear on the flight because I'm telling you, this song, these songs are everything. But um, anyway, so I'm, I'm, I just... The start of the song definitely got me again. So she said, I ain't taking your shit tomorrow. No. Then she goes on to say, we can do it my way. So I ain't sticking around no more. Right? Like, I'm done. We're just going to do this my way. Because I've had enough of your ish. And I'm not taking it today. And I'm not taking it tomorrow. We're just going to do it my way. Because I'm not sticking around no more. Right? So then she said, because you just want to play with my heart. Nobody has time for that. Nobody is in the mood for that. This is 2021. Women are over that, right? So she said, because you just want to play with my heart. And I see you with the girl at the party, right? So she's all in all her feels, in all her mood right now. You know, she better than me because his eye is blackening up if I see it, right? So then she says, you think I'm just going to stand on by and watch you waste my time? This is my life you're talking about, Summer. We felt you on that. Exactly. She said, you think I'm just going to stand on by and watch you waste my time? Boy, I am way too fine. So I am out. And you just, have you gotten in that? Like, men forget. Don't they? They forget how fine you are. They forget the reason why they're in your face in the first place. Like, I don't have time for that. I'm not taking your itch today, tomorrow. None of that. I'm on my way out. I'm too fine for it. Right? So then she said, I guess I'm unloyal, babe. Oh, my God. This song. This is my song. I'm sorry. You guys know how I am when I get a song that I'm going to love. So she said, I guess I'm unloyal, baby. I guess I'm untrue. We'll call it what you want. I guess I'm unloyal. That's in the chorus. I guess I'm untrue. Also, call me whatever you want to call me. You can call me unloyal. You can call me untrue. But you must call me still over it. <laughs> That's what Summer Walker had to say on this album, okay? So this, in verse 2, she goes on to say, You think that I need you, boy? You funny. I got my own money, so I'm going to show you. You swear I'm going to be lonely? Guess you don't know me, babe. Mm, right? So that's it. Because you, he obviously was thinking... That she can't do this without him. Right? That's that's the thing that men get caught up in all the time. She said, I guess I'm unloyal, babe. Because I'm about to show you. Right? Then that instrumental comes in and I be like, damn. I'm supposed to be mad in London on the track. And here he come with that fire. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So he brings that fire and the instrumental comes in on the song. And I'm like, dang it. I want you with Summer, but I don't want you with Summer. I want you with Summer in the studio. But leave her alone, you know, so you're going to have a whole bunch of emotions if you're deeply invested in this story, right? But look, if you're not listening to Summer Walker, you're listening to Ari Lennox. That's right. That's where we all are right now, right? So Ari comes in. Mm, this verse right here. 
<laughs> this verse right here for my friends, they know. This verse right here. So she said, um, Ari comes in. She said, I said you could come and pick up your ish. Acting like you paying for ish. Broke. Like, you should just hear the little song, the parts that come. She said, acting like you paying for ish. Broke. She said, with your bow wow do rag on. Outside with your doggy bag. Itch, I'm so done with that, she said. Tell me how a grown man so childish. This song, I'm sorry, I'm trying not to sing because that may be hurting my listeners' ears. She said, tell me how a grown man so childish. Always in Kevin Samuel's comments. When she said always in Kevin Samuel's comments, I fell out. I was not ready. I was not prepared. Hello. Everybody know that guy she's talking about that does that, right? So she said, tell me how a grown man so childish. Always in Kevin Samuel comments. That part, all right. So then she said, you think I'm just going to stand on by and watch you waste my time? Boy, I'm too damn fine. And they remind them once again, guess I'm unloyal, babe. Ah, look, if you're not listening to the new Summer Walker album, Still Over It, then you're asleep and I'm over you. Like this, I'm telling you, it's everything. I love um, Toxic. I love, you know, again, I love screwing. I love unloyal. Like, there's so many songs on there. But you know what was really, really beautiful about Summer Walker's album that a lot of people, we all just grabbed, we just went to that right away. Um, the end of the album, Sierra's Prayer. Yes, have you heard it? Sierra prayed for the whole nation, baby. No, Sierra prayed for the world with that prayer. Do you hear me? She prayed for women who don't even know they want somebody right now in their life. Like that prayer just was fire. She went all the way in, right? So if you have not heard Sierra's prayer at the end of the album, you definitely need to listen to that also. But I guess I'm my lawyer fans because I have to get ready to close this out. But that is my song. A loyal was definitely it. It made the lyrics break down. It's kind of hard to get one to make the lyrics break down, right? But that one definitely did it. I'm feeling Summer and Ari on the lyrics. It's everything. So definitely let them know. D Shield said that you need to listen to this song and then tweet me. I appreciate that. You can find me on socials. I am D Shields. I am your podcast host and as well as i'm on wisdom stage as your top mentor on wisdom so please you could just find me on the wisdom app join wisdom app if you have yet to do so very much like club clubhouse but more one-on-one so you can jump on one of our stages and have a one-on-one conversation i welcome you on mine thank you to my social audio audience over on wisdom you can find me on wisdom i am d shields or find me on the podcast, wherever you listen to your podcast, I am there. Apple Podcasts, Google Podcasts, iHeart, um, Spreaker, uh, where, YouTube, wherever you listen to your podcast, I am there. So I guess I'm unloyal, baby. I'm going to go listen to the song again because I can't get enough of it and I have to leave. Thank you all so much for taking a listen. Share, share, and share again. <laughs>